Claudia has a question also, a, a recent graduate who was with Cindy's group that she hosted. She says, during the two weeks between the blood tests that take place during the program, my cholesterol numbers were actually up. Why is that? Could could it be indicative of a blockage? And no, no. What happens is in a blood test. Let's uh, take everyone out of the awe of blood tests. Is that you're getting a snapshot of what's happening in the blood serum. The blood serum is the river that flows through our bloodstream or through our veins, I should say, and ventricles, and literally carry cells. And those cells go to certain places to create organs in your body, to flush toxins and poisons out, to hydrate the body, providing you're not one of the 60% that do not have adequate amounts of healthy fluid every day in your diet. And so all of that is what the bloodstream is. But on the other hand, when you start to have higher numbers, what it shows is that she had lodged in organs of her body and ventricles of her body, cholesterols and fats. Once we started to emulsify them through living properly, they went into the bloodstream, voila, we take a needle, pull out blood, and we find higher amounts of cholesterol there. That makes a whole lot of sense. Now, many other people, and the majority, by the way, reverse it. And that's because they didn't have as deep-seated cholesterol in their system as, as Cindy did. And so this is not uncommon, and as time goes on, as, as listeners may know, uh, we have generally a 50-point drop in cholesterol during the three-week program. But there's always 10 to 20% of our guests that have a little bit higher incidence of this. And it's okay because if you maintain the lifestyle within a matter of six months, everyone will have balanced cholesterol levels.